Um, may you tell us, was your marriage an arranged marriage or is it a love marriage? <laughs> <laughs> I had the feeling I just recognized my future husband. I've seen him and I thought like, this man I'm going to marry one day. Sie hat wirklich gesagt, nein, es gibt nur einen Mann und für den war sie. Und an diesem Punkt war mir dann auch klar, dass ich Dinge tun muss, die ich vorher noch nie getan habe. Yeah, there's this, this, this girl, you know, she's interested in you. <laughs> And I was like, no, no, I'm, I'm completely fine. I was really like... It was actually in um, in spring 2019 when I've seen him first. It was in a video of our friend Ananda Krishna Prabhu. He has a channel also on YouTube, and he's interviewing different devotees. Out of a sudden, somehow the video popped up on my computer, and I was listening to it, and I was so impressed. And I somehow I heard his voice first, and then I seen him I was listening to this lecture and I was so so touched because I had the feeling I just recognized my future husband I've seen him and I thought like this man I'm going to marry one day and <laughs> I must I must say I always since I'm a small child I had this desire and I always said like either I recognize my husband first or he's not going to be my my husband I need to If I see this man, I, I know that it's him. And I was also praying uh, to Krishna and to Radharani especially. I was saying, please Radharani, give me a sign whether he is really my husband or not. I've seen him quite often here in the temple. And every time I saw him, I left the room. I said, I don't want to see him. And I told Krishna, now it has to stop, it has to stop. But I had so many signs, so many things happened. And they showed me, no, he's the one. But I kept silence. I told nobody about it, also not my parents. At one point, my mother was cooking lunch in the kitchen. And I just came to her and then I told her everything and about all my feelings I had because I told her, you know, when, I, when I've seen him the first time, I had such a strong connection that I had this really strong feeling that I know him. Ich habe gedacht, ich kriege sie nie verheiratet, was der Mann alles haben muss und können muss und nicht essen darf und nicht trinken darf und gescheit muss er sein und älter muss er sein und das war ganz, ganz wichtig für Amrita. Man muss auch noch dazu sagen, dass Amrita ja ähm, in Deutschland groß geworden ist. Sie ist in normale Schulen gegangen, nicht in die Waldorfschule oder so, sie ist in normale Schulen gegangen. Sie ist allem ausgesetzt gewesen, Partys, Alkohol, Drogen, alles was es gibt, gibt es bei uns in Deutschland, in den Schulen, überall und auch dem Jungs. Aber sie ist jetzt wirklich ihren Weg gegangen, sie ist immer standhaft gewesen, sie hat gesagt, nein, sie hat nicht nach links und rechts geguckt, sie hat immer gesagt, es gibt für mich nur einen Mann, nicht hier, nicht da, nein, es gibt nur einen. Sie hatte nie einen Freund, so wie das modern ist in der heutigen Zeit. Sie hat wirklich gesagt, nein, es gibt nur einen Mann und für den warte ich. Krishna wird mir den schon schicken. Und das fand ich immer so besonders an ihr, dass sie wirklich... Und deswegen haben wir sie auch dahin geführt, weil ich wusste, jetzt ist es wirklich, ihr Herz ist offen, das ist der Richtige. Ein anderer kommt nicht mehr in Frage. Weil sie ist zu schüchtern gewesen, sie hat ihn nie angesprochen, nie. You ask them, your mommy and your daddy, yes. to 
t- uh, no, no. get no. in contact? No. No, 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 never ever would I have asked them, really never. I just talked to my mom and I said, but keep it for yourself, don't tell anybody. Well, but she, she didn't really ask them to do it, but I think she, her mother realized her desire and the intensity of her desire. Yes. So she just decided to, 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 to convince her husband, <laughs> the father, to go ahead with some some arrangements. Ich bin dann ja auch zu Arjuna gegangen habe gesagt, du musst das jetzt so machen, so macht man das, das ist wichtig. Sie wird ihn nie ansprechen, dann wird es immer irgendwo hinter der Blume stehen. Und an diesem Punkt war mir dann auch klar, dass ich Dinge tun muss, die ich vorher noch nie getan habe. Das heißt, jemanden ansprechen, einen Mann, den ich vorher noch nie gekannt habe oder gesehen habe, ob er meine Tochter heiraten will, war für mich auch ein schwieriger und ein neuer Schritt. Und dann one day my brother comes and says, Govind, I need to talk to you, somebody called. And um, yeah, there's this, this, this girl, you know, she's interested in you. <laughs> and I was like, no, no, I'm, I'm completely fine. I, I was really like very detached at that point. I was not really interested in um, starting a relationship. But then I, I'm, one part of myself was like, I was actually praying for something like this. I was praying that if somebody's going to come in my life, then it should come by itself, it should be an arrangement for Krishna. I don't want to do any endeavors from my side towards that direction. Um, and if there's, if it's somebody who's really yeah, pure, somebody who's really um, dedicated, a devotee, then I'm really, maybe if Krishna sends somebody like that. But my first reaction was to, I was like, no, I, I don't, I'm not interested. Um, but then my brother was uh, talking a little bit more about her and about her parents and her parents, you know, are devotees and they, they called, you know. So then I was like, well, actually, this this sounds amazing. This is incredible. Like this is sounds like almost like what I'm what I'm praying for. You know, <laughs> I never met any of them before. So when they finally arrived, I was so happy to meet them, to meet Prem Arjuna Prabhu and Prem Yashoda Mataji. They uh, just conquered me with their with their smile, with their uh, beautiful uh, effulgence, and I just fell in love with their parents for sure first. <laughs> <laughs> It's a big responsibility you know, to take for society at large together to like build a family. Um, and we had a very nice, um, the, the ladies went to the henna evening and the boys went to the lake and we had we did the traditional Haldi turmeric uh, ceremony. And I was talking to a few different friends also there and we were talking about how it's uh, very important actually to, to take this decision. Not that not everybody, especially in modern times, the tendency is to avoid, you know, family life, the responsibility of actual, you know, marriage. Um, so for me, the meditation was really to uh, take this responsibility to uh, build a family, to, you know, create a, a core in society. What's happening now? Now my hair will be removed, beard gone, hair will go back and then I'll smear myself with, oh, it will smear with turmeric. It's for cleansing the skin, but it also is considered to actually cleanse the saddle body. Uh, it's very traditional before weddings. Oh and why are you shaving your beard and your hair? I actually took it a little bit of as um, a tapasya to leave the beard until I get married. So now I'm taking it off. And also look a little bit younger.
Yeah, I would say the marriage life is, is, is it's the core of culture, maybe. Also, like the marriage ceremony is a very beautiful expression of culture. And from this, you know, from this, then the whole remaining spiritual culture can also grow, develop, expand. Mm. So this was my main, main meditation to yeah, develop community and family in Krishna consciousness. <laughs> both have such a strong connection that we need each other to uh, serve Radha Krishna and in the end come back to them together and that we need this empowerment and this pushing of each other and this has been actually also my meditation yesterday at the, our big wedding day that I realized that now it really happened that all my prayers starting from childhood um, came true and that Krishna really fulfills desires and he gives you everything you are dreaming you're wishing for you just need to be patient Wir sind vereint in Harmonie und Liebe und Liebe unseren Gelübden und unseren Herzen unseren Gelübden und unseren Herzen wow super oder <lacht> Cooking today. Ah. Good bit. And successful? Yes.
我的，全部都搞掉了。